Hey there, today this is going to be a pretty quick video showing how to resize an image on Mac OS. Uh, so that'll work on your iMac, your MacBook, and it's using tools that are already built in to Mac OS. So no third party downloads. Now the short version of this is you can right click any image you want to open here and choose preview. And you can see there's a pretty large image I've got, but if I go up here to tools, and then down to adjust size. I can change the size here and it will give me an estimate of the file size after it's done. So that's the short and easy version um, and I'll go into more details here, but if that's all you needed, thank you for watching. So what is going on in this window here? Well, you can see I've got the dimensions here. I've got the resolution, which we're not gonna touch that at all. And then I've got a couple check boxes and Again, down here, the estimate of the size of the file. So the width and height here are going to be the main things you'll edit. Uh, but generally, you're going to want to leave this locked. So this says maintain aspect ratio, which uh, this will also set that. This checkbox does the exact same thing as that lock. But basically what that does is you can see if I set this to, let's say, 1,000 pixels across, it automatically made the height 750 because it knows that that's the right proportions based on this one I've set. And likewise, if I set this to 1,000, it knows to set the top one to 1333. And you can see I've got a much smaller file size here. So this is helpful if some form that you're trying to upload an image to only allows up to a certain size file. We'll go ahead and hit OK. And don't worry, it's not actually this small. It's just in comparison to the original size it was. So if I close this again, and let's say I reopen it again in preview, I'm gonna show you what happens if we don't scale proportionately. Cool, so here we've got the same image. I'm gonna to go to adjust size. And here if I unlock this or I unselect scale proportionately, and let's say I make the height 500. Now you can see it didn't adjust my width. So here's what happens if I hit OK. Now you can see my image is squished and it's all out of proportions here. That is what we don't want. So uh, typically, unless it doesn't matter for the image that you're working on, you just want to keep that checked all the time. So anyways, I hope that was helpful. Um, like I said, nice quick video and hopefully it gets you on your way. Thanks for watching.